Let's practice counting with our snowman. How many snowman do you see? I see one, two, three. Three snowmen. What if we add two more snowmen? Adding is when there are more. I'm going to add one, two more snowmen. How many do we have all together? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, and five. We had three, and then we added two more, and now we have five. Let's put them all together. We have five snowmen. What happens if we add five more snowmen? Here are five snowmen. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, and five. Let's add five more snowmen. One, two, three, four, five. We had five snowmen and now we added five more snowmen. How many do we have all together? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We had five and added five more and now we have ten snowmen. Five plus five is ten. We can say equals. Five plus five equals ten. Can you say that? Five plus five equals ten. We have a chocolate egg. Let's use our five senses to see if some of them can help us to learn or understand more about this egg. Hmm, what do you see? I see a chocolate egg and it is the color brown. Do you know what shape the egg is? It's kind of like a circle, but it's longer. This is an oval shape. Let's see if we can hear anything inside the egg. Let's use our ears to hear. Hmm, I wonder what that sounds like. I wonder what could be inside. Hmm, maybe we can smell the egg. Does it smell sweet? Does it smell like chocolate? Hmm, maybe we can taste the egg. I broke off a little piece of chocolate. Let's taste it. Mmm, it tastes sweet and chocolatey. Hmm, what else can we do? We can feel it. It feels very smooth. The egg feels very smooth. I think we should open it and see what's inside. Let's open it. Surprise! What is that? It's a snowman. What do you see? Our snowman is white with three black buttons and an orange carrot nose. We found a snowman inside our chocolate egg. Hello, snowman. Hello. Would you like to help me make some pretend Christmas cookies? I have some dough. It's very squishy. How many cookies should we make? Let's make three cookies. Let's separate the dough into three piles. One, two, and three. Now let's roll each pile into a ball. Let's roll the first pile. Let's roll the second pile. And let's roll the third pile. Now, let's get our rolling pin and we'll roll out our cookies. Let's roll out our first cookie. Let's roll out our second cookie. And now let's roll out our third cookie. 
We have three cookies. Hmm, what should we add onto our cookies? I have some sprinkles. Let's add some sprinkles onto our cookies. They're looking so yummy. Hmm, I wonder if we waved our magic Christmas wand, if they would turn into real cookies. Let's see. Wow, they turned into some real Christmas cookies. Let's use our five senses to see if we can learn more about them. What do you see? I see three cookies. One, two, three. What kind of colors do you see? I see two blue cookies with white and blue sprinkles. And I see one white cookie with blue and white sprinkles. Hmm, what do you hear? Let's break them in half and let's see what we can hear. Wow, we can hear them break apart. There are some soft cookies inside. I wonder what we can feel. I can feel the icing. It's coming off the cookie. It feels a little bit rough and the cookie feels smooth. I can feel the snowflake sprinkles. They're bumpy on the cookie. What can we smell? They smell sweet and yummy. What can we taste? Let's take a little bite. Mmm, they are so sweet and yummy. I can taste the cookie and the frosting. Let's leave some of our cookies out for Santa. How many cookies should we leave him? Here's one cookie, and here's two cookies. Let's leave him two cookies, one and two. What else could we leave Santa? How about some carrots for his reindeer? That's a great idea. How many carrots should we leave him? How many can you count? One, two, and three. Let's leave him three carrots for his reindeer. What can we leave Santa in our Santa mug? Hmm, that's right. We should leave him some milk. Milk tastes so yummy with cookies. Let's pour him some milk in our Santa mug. What else could we leave out for Santa? Let's write him a letter. Hmm, I'm not sure how to spell Santa. Do you know? Let's sound it out. Santa. It starts with the letter S. S. That's right. Let's start with the letter S. Let's sound it out again. S. I think the next letter is. Yes, it's the letter A. San. N. What letter sounds like N? It's N. Let's keep sounding out the word Santa. Sant. T. Hmm. What letter makes a t sound? It's T. And there's one more letter left. Santa. It's another A. It's the letter A again. We spell Santa S A N T A. Now we can write him our letter. Hmm. What should we ask Santa for? Maybe we could ask him for some Christmas books or a tea set or some toys. Maybe we could even ask him for a teddy bear or a soft Santa toy. <laughs> Where is snowman? Where is snowman? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, snowman? Very well, I thank you. Roll away. Roll away. Where is reindeer? Where is reindeer? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, reindeer? Very well, I thank you. Fly away. Fly away. Where 
is Santa? Where is Santa? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, Santa? Very well, I thank you. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas.